old man. Let's see. I think some of those, uh, you know, portraits and whatnot are from previous games. Bravery, Gwendolyn, bravery! This older brother. <laughs> yeah, she's a sprite one. Well, hello, cousin. Oh, cousin. <laughs> I'm glad you're finally here. He's been asking about you for days. I had to sit through the same story five times. We got here as fast as we could, and I like Grandpa Stray, especially the one with dragons. Oh yes. The legendary beast he outsmarted with its own dinner bell. Hey. I don't know if he forgets that I've heard that story before, <coughs> just doesn't care, but he loves telling it to anyone that will listen. I'm of pretty course. sure I heard the nursemaids telling these same jokes in the hall. Have you heard anything the doctors are saying? Yes, mm -hmm. doctors, wizards, magic elves. Grandfather is fine, Gwendolyn. They all say the same thing. Mm -hmm. He's just old. He still has a few good years left. Mm -hmm. Look, we're all excited that your family made the trip, but there's no need to worry. You should get some rest. I'm sure you're scheduled for a full morning of Grandfather's hilarious ramblings. Oh, I'm also scheduled for the tournament tomorrow. Ah, oh, yes, the fencing tournament. You'll love it. I'm, of course, favored to win, and we'll make sure you have the very best seat to view my victory. The courtyard will be filled with important people and delicious hors d'oeuvres. Um, I'm actually competing in the tournament. Hmm. I had no idea we were hosting a junior tournament. <coughs> That's incredible. In that case, I will gladly be there to cheer you on and eat delectable appetizers. Nope. No junior tournament. I'll be squaring off against you. <laughs> I see. Well, perhaps this is the time to stop listening to stories and finally make some of your own. Good night, Gwendolyn. Sleep well. Alright, times he seems pompous and full of himself, and then, you know, he seems like a good guy. Aww. Hello, Grandpa. Come in, Gwendolyn. You can set those on the knives there. Grandma said to take three spoonfuls of each. Of oh, each? Yes, God. God, that's a lot of spoonfuls to take. More important issues. Fencing tournament. I hear you're competing. Well, I signed up, but I'm not so sure anymore. Nonsense. If it's God you're worried about, please <coughs> don't bother. After all, I will learn that you entered after he complained about it all morning. Threatened, I'm guessing. <laughs> there are many ways to win a duel. I, for one, have always been fond of... Hmm. A quick witted distraction. A in a different way. Finding a clever distraction to create a moment of victory. Speaking of, that reminds me of a story. One I know you haven't heard before. When I was a much younger lad, before I was a knight, before I'd been to Daventry, and even before I had seen a dragon. It's a tale about a tournament that changed my life. <laughs> <laughs> it is a long story, but I shall tell it briefly. A long story, but I'll tell it briefly. You know, keep it short well, and sweet. Well, this looks as good a place as any to camp for the night. Let's rest up. We have a big day tomorrow. What the heck is that? Uh, horse? Guinea pig thing? <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Okay, you're a bit clumsy, ain't you? Ouch. Ouch. Boom. Ouch. Ow. 
Alright, so I can control him a little bit. Ouch. Okay, that was a long fall. <laughs> I welcome the sight of an actual road, the first sign of civilization. Now, if only I had my horse thing. Triumph! Can we go this way? Um. Triumph to me, my Grandpa. You can't leave Triumph. No, I can't. Oh, Larry, Triumph can fend for himself. We've been through our share of sticky situations, <coughs> but he always comes around when I need him most. Deus ex, whatever that is, guinea pig thing, my jigger. <laughs> Diamond Tree was just a few miles to east. I've read all about its wonders in my travel books. I couldn't wait to check out its famous, fantastical floating island. Huh. There seems to be a road missing here. And some high-stepping knights. Thump, thump. Oh. Alright, what the heck is it? A dog? Of some sort? I don't know, what? Hello, knight. Hello, big knight. What the heck are these? Obviously not horses. Say hello to my little friend. <coughs> hello. Hello. Hey, listen. Day. I should have been with them, marching with triumph. It seemed my first few minutes in Daventry were off to a terrible start. So, how did you catch up with them? Uh, big horn, yay. Oh, no. The odd horn seemed to be missing some sort of mouth key. All right, can't go down there. Oh, what shall I find here? Uh, and I'm just thinking of the tracks, blaze the trail to the forest. Oh, fun. Thinking of the name of this chapter, A Night to Remember, makes me think of a saying I've heard. Once a king, always a king. But once a knight is never enough. Ooh, whatever came through here, you know, left quite a big trail. Um, there's a box up there. Can I get the box somehow? Tracks continue on this way. But what's this way? I'm a curious sort, I am. Can I climb the tree? Get the box. I <laughs> Ouch. Oh. Hey, hey, oh, no, 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 no. Well, I'll pick up the toolbox. I'll probably be able to get the tools along the way. <coughs> Where did they drift down to? Carriage gone haywire. Hello. What are those little things? Back, you dirty thieves. Ouch. Oh, it's just a boy. Don't 
don't know where he's from, but it must be hard to pronounce. You know, you should never sneak up on a guy in a dangerous place like... No! What's wrong with your foot? Probably stepped on a spiniferous thornweed. Don't worry, I got just the fix for that. Tell me, is it more of a... Oh! Or a... Oh! oh. Either way, the Merchant of Miracles has got you covered. <laughs> the most rare, miraculous, mysterious, and oftentimes delicious ingredients. Ah, here it is. I massage this into my skin twice a day, and just look at my little biscuits. <clears throat> well, now that I've molded over, you'd better not. It might stunt your growth. Ooh, such exquisite material. Hey. Mm -hmm. I knew you weren't from around here. Well, you best get going. Nobody likes a late night. Oh, wait. You're stuck here with me. Every virgin is out, and my shortcut had a few shortcomings. I swear that rock leaped straight out of the water. Now I'm stuck here with no wheel, a lost toolbox, and Mr. Fancy Cakes. Say, I'll bet a fine, strapping young man like you could help me fix up this wheel. Yep, you help me fix my chariot, and I'll give you a lift to the tournament. Hopefully, no one else notices your horrible lack of punctuality. <laughs> oh, how rude! Do you have any questions for me? Um. Nope. Uh, nope. I got most of that. Uh, you want me to get your wheel, your toolbox? My God, I sent your toolbox down the river. I'll find it. I'll find it. Brags, nub it. The wheel was very broken. I would have to find another solution. And I lost the tools from the toolbox. <laughs> the only tool left seemed to be a small hatchet. And no, Gwendolyn, before you start asking me thousands of questions about that hatchet, <laughs> I did not go around using it on everything. Oh no, we didn't use it on everything. Nope, didn't use it on anything at all. I might use it on this. There was no reason to chop down a perfectly good tree. Nope, no reason at all. And I've got five money. The only money I have to my name. Alright, so I gotta find a better wheel. Uh, do 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 do. 